Okay, y'all. Happy Sunday. Happy Sunday. So, excuse the noise because I'm on the go. So, this is the Aldi Sneak Peek Finds. This is for the week of September 8th, next week on Wednesday. So, well, this week coming. So, first they have the Huntington Home Reversible Comforter. That's $16.99. They have the Huntington Home Twin or Twin Extra Large Sheet Set, which is what we used for our son when he went off to college. And I will be trying to get some more in blue for him. For $7.99, you can't beat that. You have some, ooh, they got candles, y'all. They got candles, $4.99. The candles are $4.99. Do you see that? two wick candle the scented oh my goodness and 3.99 each the smoke pumpkin cider the honey glaze pear cider the pumpkin ginger snap oh shout out to ginger snap 44 that is that's my girl um and then they also have some huntington home shear or metallic window panels now we have on the back you can enhance your space with the letter board how awesome is that to have that in your background if you do a live video that would be awesome shout out to you content creators who are out there um working hard at what you do i appreciate you um they also have the easy home fabric power strips those are 9.99 they even have the expandable file cabinet here as well as over here, they got the sling chair. Now that is cute. That will look good. <gasps> that will look good on my son. Oh, never mind. I'm about to tell how my house looks. Okay, so this is nice. $39.99. And it comes in more colors. They have gray, a darker blue, and that looks like a black. Y'all know I'm colorblind. So um they have some that wind blowing. Easy home flexible surge power protectors as well for um, $16.99. And then over here they have some home peel and stick wall tiles. Wow, for $14.99. They have dishcloths, pot holders, oven mitts, and towels for $3.99. And then at the bottom, they have some ground bison. Oh, wow, for $7.99 a pound. Um, and that's the 16 ounce pack. And then they also have the Steakhouse Season Tavern beef patties. That's 1.33 pounds for $5.99. So it also says on here, I'm noticing, due to shipping delays, some advertise all the items may not be available for purchase so we apologize for the inconvenience so that's letting you know y'all these things are in limited 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 supply so go out to aldi and get what you need um and then get what you want and everything will work itself out in the end so let's prep today so we can be prepared for tomorrow and let's get into the video you know i love music Welcome back to the channel. If you are new, thank you for being here. If you are returning, thank you for coming back. And if you have not subscribed, go ahead and hit that red button and turn on that notification so you'll know when I upload my next video. Also, share the video out if you can because it does help the channel. And did I say like that video? Yeah, like that video. So we're about to head into the Aldi. This is my last store of the day. This is actually my fourth store, if I'm not mistaken, of the day. I guess I can call it my fourth store because I went into the Dollar Tree slash Family Dollar Combo Store. Um, if you haven't seen that video, please go check it out over on Tommy Bites Life. Tommy Bites Life. Tommy Bites Life so <laughs> let me stop acting crazy um i haven't decided which channel i'm gonna put this video on but 
either way it go y'all we're about to go in and see exactly what's going on in the aldi's over here i have not been here in a few months and i just want to see what they have see if there's anything i want to get and i have to go home and put what i do have up so once again prep today so you are prepared for tomorrow if you are starting a garden or thinking about starting a garden go ahead and sow something today so you can grow something tomorrow and that will add to your prepper pantry you don't have to have a big yard in order to have a garden you really really don't um, there are channels out there that can show you how you can grow without having a big yard or actually planting directly into the ground. I also do that on my channel. So check out my garden playlist and holla at your girl. So um, let's go into the store on a serious tip. Um, I've always said, and I'm gonna continue to say, we are one emergency, one crisis away from not having anything. And I think I got here maybe at the right time because I see a truck coming in. So I'm looking forward to going in this store, although they're not going to have it out while I'm out. I'm pretty sure the store is not going to have any shortages. Let me know right now in the comments. I'm going to tag this. That way I can see if you think the store has shortages or not. Or if you think the store is a fully stocked store. I love seeing fully stocked stores. Y'all probably think I like seeing shortages. I don't because that means somebody's child somewhere is going to go hungry because somebody is not setting aside extra food or water for their family in case of hard times. Things may be good where you are, but in the flash of an eye, blink of an eye, I think that's how you said, blink of an eye, it can change. And we saw that happen storm after storm. We just had Hurricane Ida and things might have been fully stocked on their shelves there. But afterwards, no. Either it got damaged from water or the store, you know, the winds gone. What didn't get damaged, people were in lines, 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 and lines waiting to get into the store hoping that there was something left and i'm sure they had limits on those items in that store so that people can have what they need why does person park next to me when i have all these parks out here blasting their music why why y'all let me go in the store love y'all so i'm gonna try to give y'all the full experience if you've never been to an aldi you're gonna put your quarter in and it pushes that piece right here out and then you take your buggy and you can get your quarter back when you're done. I don't know if I can record in here or not, but we're gonna try. And yes, I have a crappy buggy. It's the bread over here on the left. That's what it's looking like. It looks okay. And again, you can get your fresh fruits your vegetables and you can can them if you want to you can freeze them if you want to any of that stuff so you got some salami right here which i don't eat but that's a good price i guess got your beef jerkies chips and popcorn salsa yeah this area over here with the healthier items i'm gonna grab this i've not seen this before so, uh, probiotic as pomegranate and 
blackberries. This is the coffee. Over here, some other drinks. We have an empty shelf up here. And down here. see a limit on any canned goods as of yet y'all so you still got time to get your canned goods and they're 35 cents I don't know what these taste like but they're 35 cents so I'm gonna grab some of these happy harvest tomato sauces they're 19 cents so you can't beat that. So I got 24 of these cans for 19 cents. It's gonna cost me $4.54 for these 24 cans. So far, everything is looking not too bad. It's just a few gaps in here in certain areas. rice area and you got your pet food cat dog pet it's a little low get your, your toilet paper area it's looking like I don't see any limits on anything, so that's a plus. I don't know what this little area is, but it's empty. They good on water, y'all. I just bought that water for a flipping dollar, and they got it in here for 55 cents. Are you serious? I bought four of these gallon waters from Family dollar, dollar tree, whatever. Four dollars. I could have saved some money. I could have saved some money. Kitchen area. Let's see how much this duck is going for because we have duck on the homestead. So I could actually sell, raise them and sell them for $45? Wow, y'all. You got space, raise some meat animals. This little area is looking like with the milk. They do have some right there they gotta put out. So y'all, all I'm gonna get out of here is my tomato sauce and then that probiotic drink that I saw. That's the only thing I'm getting out of here and I'm gonna call it quits because I need to get up out of here. There's way too many people and it's not even late in the day to be out here. It's like we're running in circles Going around every day Getting stuck in the hurdles Of yesterday Don't you want to go further Away from the fray Let's not get stuck in our worries We'll make our own way Won't you come outside Where the sunflowers bloom Breathe in the air 
Look up to the moon. I'll meet you outside.